Well, we've added our people, we've created our content, we've published and shared our content with our people, and they're actively working on it. So what the heck does that actually look like? Let's check it out. Now I'm logged in here as a general user, and this is how I'm going to experience the content that gets assigned to me. Very first thing I see is my to-do list. This is where I'm going to see everything that's been specifically assigned to me that I need to complete. Really easy to hop in. I'm just gonna click start, takes me in, I'm able to see the content, I review it, mark it complete, moves me on to the next one. I can keep right on going through that content just like I normally would. And I can keep right on going through all that content until I'm all the way done. Woohoo! All done. And now I get to move on to, oh, check it out, a test. There we go. Back on the home page, I can always check out my current progress and measure myself against the rest of the company. Yeah, looks like I've got some work to do. I can also easily favorite any of my subjects here. That way they pop over on the right hand side for easy access. If you enable these features for your team members, they'll be able to click on the content page to see all the content and they'll be able to see the directory and org chart as well. And that's how your general users will experience Trainial. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Now, if you really want to master Trainial, check out Trainial University in the link below.